does it feel to have Miranda's victim as the opening night film for the Santa Barbara International Film Festival? I mean, we couldn't be more excited, absolutely. We're, I think, I can speak for all of us when we're, we're all over the moon. <laughs> yeah, it's such a wonderful festival and I love Santa Barbara, so. Can you talk a little bit about taking on such an intense role? Yes, it was tricky, of course, because, you know, it's a real life person. Um, so we had to pay respects, you know, to preserve some authenticity about it. Um, I mean, from my point of view, everyone is such an established actor and they've done such wonderful work. For me, it's more so like, you know, I'm more up and coming, I have to say. It's like a first, this is my first leading role. So I definitely try to put the most amount of effort and, and uh, you know, put everything I have into it so I could deliver, you know, hopefully I could live up to their standards, basically. Well, That's what I, I was trying to do. I have do. a feeling you do. Oh, thank you. Um, what do you want audiences to take away from this film? I mean, it's such an incredible... We are just talking to Michelle Dan, Yes. And she was saying how this is almost the 60th anniversary since this happened. And no one has told the story until now. Yeah. It's, up, it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Because everyone knows about the Miranda rights. Everyone knows the famous phrase. But the actual story behind it was pretty crazy. And, you know, and it's crazy that the real life of Ernesto Miranda has yeah. been like the poster child of criminal justice but at the same time he did some bad things you know he was not a perfect man so it's it, it you know it reflects life everything has layers everything's you know nuanced uh, so I would like I, I would hope that the audience could, was able to like figure out those nuances and like make a judgment for themselves like the importance of the Miranda rights but also how important it was for Trish to be able to be able to tell her story and find closure, exactly. you know, at the end of the day. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, it, looking forward to it and looking forward you. to your work. What's next for you? Um, I'm currently on the show for Peacock called Based on a True Story and have a funny little cameo um, on the movie Family Leave with Jennifer Garner and Ed Helms oh, on the for Netflix. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. It should I really be out next year. I'm going to see you back here on the red carpet a lot of times. I would love to. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank Enjoy you. Enjoy tonight. Thank you. Thank you.